Christ. <laughs> Welcome to my world. Things will be a little different tonight. For one thing, I'll try not to kill myself while I'm up here. For another, I'd like to take a moment and acknowledge this silly little holiday we're having. I'm very excited about it, aren't you? Oh, good. There's something I wanted to ask you. I've been thinking about it a lot. Around the world at this time of year, the barrier between your world and mine, the fantastical and the mundane, the living and the dead, and the light and, well, the shadow, gets so very thin, and we create these, these holidays, these festivals, these celebrations, in the Far East, we have the festival of hungry ghosts. We raise the dead. And then Zong Kwai, the demon eater, returns them. In the South, Dia de las Muertos, Day of the Dead. Fancy little altars that summon up our revered ancestors, and at the end of a night of frivolity, we have a to send them back to the grave. And here in the States, we have a tarted up children's holiday. Where we seem to cut loose and show off our real selves for one night and <laughs> anything goes. But at the stroke of midnight, it's all back the way it was. Why is that? Why? I think I know the answer. I think you're afraid. I think you're ill-prepared to live in a world that is constant madness. But tonight, we're running late, and you're in my world now. Yeah.